around the world, around our community. This is TSU TV News for October the 22nd, 2013. I'm LaVonda James. In the news this hour, college students and Christian values. Is there a connection? A down South campus organization changes lives for the better. And get ready, Houston. An event is coming soon to Texas Southern University that you may not want to miss. These stories and more when we return. Welcome back to TSU. Away from home, with temptations all around, can Christian students really walk with Christ on campus? Well, a Christian teen article says yes. This article entitled Being a Christian on a Secular Campus, written by Kelly Mahoney, actually offers tips to Christian students on how to stay strong in faith. Mahoney advises students to join a Christian fellowship organization. Traditional Wednesdays and Sundays, she says, are just not enough. Also, Mahoney advises students to stay rooted in their word and to seek advice from youth leaders in church. If you want more on this article, you can go to about.com Christian Teens. Well, students, not only can you gain a degree at Texas Southern University, but you can also gain a relationship with God. TSU's Life Change Organization focuses on teaching students how to live a Christian life on and off campus. We're talking about the mind, your thinking, your personality, your affections. On the second floor of the Sterling Student Center, students gather to hear testimonies, singing, and biblical teachings on how their lives can be changed through Jesus Christ. You know, God wants us to do what's right and to keep His commandments. TSU students talked about what they gained from the Bible study sessions. The thing that I enjoy the most about life change is really just learning more about God. You know, learning more about like how I can cultivate having an intimate relationship with God. You know, it took me having time with myself, and man, God really showed me a lot through that, through, through the life change. Just through people that's man seeking God, seeking to make a difference from from people on campus. I think it's man, it's really a good thing. The organization's student president Cedric Stagg explained more about the goals of the group. Our goals at Life Change is truly to reconcile the student bodies back unto God. You know, many of our members that are, are truly committed to this organization have come from various backgrounds, engaged in a lot of different things, and through the work that is being taught here, you know, our lives have been changed through this work. Many of us had no direction. We had no, no hope, no future, no guidance, failing academically, grades horrible. But through this word and through the principles and learning of God, we are able to focus on God, to avoid those distractions that causes many people to not be successful academically. Our grades have increased, you know, and that, that's our goals here at Life Change. We're here live now at Texas Southern University in front of the Granville Sawyer Auditorium. TSU's Life Change organization will be presenting a live drama production entitled Becoming a True Worshipper here November the 2nd, 2013. TSU students and other members of the Truth in Action drama team worked diligently to convey a message of hope for all people. Becoming a true worshiper is filled with comedy, suspense, and action. 21 oh number 33 does it hey, again. Hey, <laughs> Pay up, Jacob. A bet hey. is a bet. That's me and Tanya's chili cheese fries on Monday. <laughs> Jacob, what are you doing, man? I'm listen, just playing. listen. Please don't shoot me. Listen. This is not the first time this drama has been performed. Director and writer Silas Stagg, who also plays the devil, spoke about the history and purpose of his production. We took it down to Lake Charles. It was really good. After we did that, we made some adjustments. Then we took it back to Houston. And when we done it in Houston, it was excellent. House, everything was filled, every seat was filled to the point people were standing up in the walls, not one dry eye in the building. So I'm hoping that people can actually begin to see themselves in this play. And when they see themselves, they can not only see themselves and where they are as far as error is concerned, but they can actually see hope that, man, there's a way out. 
Stag anticipates a life-changing effect on his audience. If you come through those doors and you sit down and you begin to look at that plate, I know for a fact that your life will never be the same. Life Change invites TSU and the surrounding community to attend at 5 p.m. November the 2nd in the Granville Sawyer Auditorium. Admission is free. I'm LaVonda James, and this has been TSU TV News.